evening, good evening everybody, how is everybody doing? Welcome to the Black Africa 2023. Let's explore Blackpool in the evening time, how it looks. You can see it here. You can see Blackpool here. Not here on this side. Uh, that's not here and uh, it's a beach and there is a uh, tower. is the Grand Hotel right in front of us. It's a Grand Hotel. So here we are. Let's take you in a tour. Let's go around and explore Blackpool at night in the evening, right? I've not done a lot of vlogging, uh, so in my face, uh, but yeah, we got to always start something new. We got to always start to do something different. It's quite windy, guys. It's really, really windy. Uh, and I haven't got my mic. I hope you guys can hear me. Uh, I just want to go right in front of the Grand Hotel. Let's cross, let's cross, let's cross. And then, uh, actually, there's a tram coming over. There's a tram. There's a tram just on its way. As you can see, we're crossing the road. So in a minute, you will see the tram coming past us. So I just want to go up, uh, to the Grand Hotel, but let's just see the tram passing by. So let's see the tram. That's the tram there. So I say it's going to go all the way to Stargate. All right. So the tram has just gone past. So let's see if we can cross the road. All right. So we're good. So we made it. So. Guys, welcome if you're just joining us. It's uh, in the evening in Blackpool. So I'm just gonna take you out in the tour to show you how it looks at night. So basically, we're just gonna show you the Grand Hotel, which is right in front of us here. So let's see, let's go this way. You guys can see. Let's adjust. That's the Grand Hotel. Right. And we are here. hotel so look at it look right we're here so we go and check in so we go and check in in the hotel for tonight as we are off so like we're going around as you can see look at it don't get dizzy though guys <laughs> let's not get dizzy you know what for the sake of just let's just go in Let's just go right through them, so we don't get told off. But here we are. Wow, looks, looks nice, huh? The Queen Street, wow, look at that. The Queen Street, Sandy Down and uh, Windsor Room, wow. So you're looking for a romance, a romantic night? Yeah, that's the Queen Street, guys. We're in the Grand Hotel, guys. We just invaded the place. But the security guys are not going to come and get us. That's it. It's a nice mirror. Guys, it's really nice in here, no? And that's the reception there. That's the reception people are booking in. Yeah? So, ooh, you broke in. I wonder if I can go and interview your the receptionist. Ask them how much, they, how much is it for night to stay here? Well, I think they're quite busy there at the moment. I think people are booking in. So we have to come back when it's a bit quiet. So yeah. Hello. <laughs> it's looking wondering what am I doing? <laughs> so guys, okay. We're gonna get through this. So as you can see. These people look like a bit of a like a business guys. They look a bit presentable. <laughs> you know. Indian guys, maybe they're business people or they're visiting, like for a business trip. Okay, let's get let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. So we just got out of the Grand Hotel, guys. See, see, it's a Grand Hotel. I don't know if you can see right. So yeah, 
just been to the Grand Hotel. Okay, that's the Grand Hotel there in Blackpool. And actually, actually, it's really, it, it really looks nice there. It, it looks, it looks nice. It used to be the. Uh, the Sarantin Hotel, then it got changed. So now you see it's a grand hotel. Let's see. Let's see. Okay, here we are. So yeah, let's see if we can cross the road and then uh, we're gonna go all the way, uh, all the way to Brisbane, like Sandcastle Way. That's what that's that's the plan. We're gonna go, that's the tower base. You can see behind us. You got the Blackpool Tower. At night is lit. You see the light? You can see in every angle in Blackpool. If you see in Blackpool, you will see the tower in every corner. Look at the sea. Look at the sea. I'm a sea person. I like to live by the sea. You know, even in Gambia, I live not far from the sea. Basically, this just reminds me of being back home. So like the OIC road, if you watch out some of my videos, see me coming out from the compound the family compound then cross the road and then I'm down to the beach and something similar here so I actually live right on them flats there right you see them flats that's where I live and the Grand Hotel is here the beach is here so basically it just reminds me back home apart from missing the sun sign you know so the only difference is not not guaranteed to have the full sun sign like we have in the Gambia so it's, that's the only I think that's the only difference and then the other thing is raining or most of the time it's raining rain rain it's wet so windy storms and all that so basically you get all kind of climate here in uh, in black you know so as you can hear you now I don't know if you can hear my voice right but it's really really windy here it's really windy so let's go so guys I look a bit hyper man <laughs> what am I on Am I on something? No, I'm just mellow, guys. I can't be involved, you know. I'm kind of a, on the big thing. There's a guy there fishing. He's going through. There's a guy fishing over there. You can see him. See him there. See him there. He's fishing. So let's go down. Follow me around. Follow me around. We're going to go that way. This way. Yeah. We're going to go underneath the... And there... Once we're done this side on the beach, we're going to go all the way. We're going to go all the way there, that way, by Brisbane, by the Sandcastle, yeah? So now we're going to go under, yeah? You see me? You see me walking down? We're walking down underneath, and then we're going to go and see the guy fishing. There's a guy fishing there, and hopefully we'll meet some nice people, and then we'll say hello to them. Uh, I'm using my phone and it's an iPhone, it's an old phone now. Actually, it's been how many years? More than 24 months. It's been, the contract was 24 months, so basically, I think I need to upgrade, guys. If anybody there wants to sponsor me a new phone, iPhone 15 Pro Max, you know, or a GoPro 12, uh, GoPro 12, yeah, the GoPro 12 is out as well. So, if anybody, oh, we're going that way. Let's go this way, and we can see the guy fishing. So, if anybody wants to sponsor me with uh, some gadgets, you're welcome. So we can give you the coverage, give you the best videos, best contents, best you know of everything. So, all right. So we we're here, we're here together, guys. I'm not begging, though. I'm not forcing anybody. So if anybody's willing to do it, then you're welcome. You know, sponsors. I mean, donation is all welcome, guys. If you want to see much of my content, of what you've seen, so guys, feel free, feel free. Then you and you're gonna see a lot. You're gonna see a lot. I'm not shy. I'm not scared. I'm willing to do anything, you know. As long as it's not illegal. Sometimes I do cross boundaries, you know. But yeah, that's the tower there. It actually looks really nice. The tower and this big wheel. You see that colorful wheel over that side. See it in the distance. That's the big wheel by the pier, by central pier. So yeah, let's go and see that gentleman there fishing. Let's go and see him. Let's see if he's caught any fish. And then we can walk through under this bay. And then later on we can uh, 
head up uh, and saw it some displayed some display on the road by what the local council is doing a tourist attraction as I say so anybody that's far from uh, somewhere from uh, the neighbor the neighboring cities or town from Blackpool uh, do visit let's see the gentleman here fishing fishing overnight how easy it looks like here. Hello, how you doing? You good? Yeah, I'm all right. You? So how's it going? Right. You fishing? You gonna be fishing? Any luck yet? Yeah. Not yet. You only just started. Wow. What are you using? Uh, what? Uh, what Worms. bait are you using? Worms. Worms. Wow. Are you doing a cocktail on it? <laughs> it's a cocktail, isn't it? Yeah, I love fishing, guys. I can't wait to get a road. How much do you reckon I can get one road like this? Say again. How much do you reckon that's going to cost me to get a road like yours? Uh, go to Cash Converse. Cash Converse? Yeah, yeah. It's the best place to go, right? Yeah, everybody, everybody puts their roads in. Yeah, when they're dry, yeah. Yeah, you get a lot Really? A good one? Yeah, with the light, with the reels and all that? Yeah, yeah, Both. He's gonna cast. Okay, let's see, guys. He's gonna cast. Let's give him a. Let's give him away. He's gonna cast. You know, let's see. He's gonna launch. He's gonna cast. Wow. Let's see. Let's see whether he's gonna. Get some bites. I'm gonna ask him what sort of fish he get get to you. It actually the real the line jam so we have to cast again. I hope it doesn't lose his bait. So the line that jumps. So, yeah. Sorry Mike. So yeah the line the line jam the real actually jumps so it's gonna sort it out uh, and it's gonna launch it again. Yeah, yeah he lost some of the bait you know Put some more baits and then it's gonna cast again. It's got like what fish is that? Wow, that'd be a good bite, isn't it? You can do a cocktail. He's doing a cocktail there. It's got worms and worms and a fish. So do you do, do you go fishing like a hobby or just a hobby? So what is if you have a catch? What you do? You take it home or you put it back? Take you home. You love fish? Yeah. All right. I do as well, mate. So what sort of fish do you catch in here? Do you? Uh, all sorts. All sorts? Sea bass. Sea bass. Cods. Cods. Right here. Yeah. Uh, Adag. Uh, oh, you like sharks. And what? Baby sharks. Baby sharks. Wow. Baby sharks. Are they the wild ones or? Wild sacks! Wow! Uh, get the wild one. Baby sacks, wild sacks. Interesting. What's the biggest you caught in here? About that. Wow! Wow! Nice! I'm gonna go and get a rod, man. A lot of fish. I'm gonna go to Cask and buy one and come and save myself a lot of money, man. See that size he got? He caught here when you go to Morrison or wherever it costs you like at least good money, you know, it's gonna cost you fortune to buy fish over here. So imagine you get a line, 15, 15 pounds, and you buy your baits. You know, the rod you can have it for years actually. So if you have your bait, all you gotta buy is a bait. So basically you're gonna fish you are gonna have fish for free. So you're gonna have fish for free, so which is good. Maybe my fishing pal, because I live not far from here, so I just come on with me and do some fishing. He's just casting into my weight. See if he gets some bites. It's quite windy though, like, see that light, that reflector there? That reflector actually shows him when he has a bite. So basically, he casts. So he's gonna go and sit here and chill and wait. It's a time in his 
occupation, isn't it? What's your name? Barry. Barry. Bas. 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 I'm Omar. Omar. Nice to meet you, bro. So I got my friend here. Are you from Blackpool? Yeah. I got a friend here. I got a pal from Blackpool now. You see, when you got when you get out of the house, you meet friends. You make friends. People in Blackpool are lovely, lovely, isn't it? Right. He's concentrated there. He's watching. So is it a good spot here? Good all over here. So is it like definitely you're gonna get in something here, you reckon? Uh, you don't know. It's just a lock. So guys, it's a matter of luck and patience, right? If somebody not got a patient, this is a good way of learning how to be patient, isn't it? Right, look. But Baz is focusing in there, a lot of focusing, that's it. So you know what? When I go fishing, the same thing applies to me. I like more focus on my, on my, on my, on my. Oh, it's is that a fight or a win? Just a win. Oh, you see, 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 see. So we got the result, guys. Nearly like looks like a result. So it's a good, you know, you got to be a good timer as well. So you see, is it the wind or it's got a bite? So you see that. You gotta be careful though, you gotta be quick as well because if you're not like it's a bike, that is definitely a bike. It's definitely a bike now. Now it's all about the timing. So guys, see Buzz is there, it's all about the timing. So that's it, let's give him away. It's about the timing guys, once you get a bite, so you gotta go for it man. You gotta be let's see, let's see, let's see. So guys see oh Again, yeah, that was a bite. That is a good sign to show that there's fish around. So that is a good sign. So he's there, he's just cast. So basically, that is a good indicator. It's indicating that he's fish here. And now he have to focus. We're gonna give him a chance to focus on the road and to see what's going on. Uh, I think there's a guy that commented actually so it was on Instagram about Stanley Stanley Park going fishing on Stanley Park for me personally I would not go to Stanley Park fishing you know what's the point going fishing in the pond or I'll go in the sea man there's a sea here come to the sea you know you can fish here if you're a fish lover you can fish here you know if it's a good catch you take it back home let me just, guys. Uh, thank you very much for, thank you very much for watching this uh, this this episode here, this part. What I'm gonna do, uh, I will come back. We'll be right back because we don't want it too long and we don't want it uh, short as well. So in case we uploading, things take a bit longer. So thanks, guys, for watching. So we should catch you up soon. If you haven't subscribed, please consider subscribing to the channel. Back to Africa 2023. So we shall see you soon, guys. Uh, bye.